Ashton Kutcher defends his post-acting career day job. Hollywood actor Ashton Kutcher has spent much of his adult life in the spotlight, but as of that 70s show star moves into his life post-acting, he has made sure to remain a light for victims of human trafficking. My day job is as the chairman and co-founder of Thorn, Kutcher told the Senate Foreign Relations Committee in February. Thorn is a non-profit organization that produces software to fight human trafficking in the sexual exploitation of children, according to Kutcher. Kutcher also revealed that his second day job as a father to his two children, 10-month-old Dimitri and 3-year-old Wyatt, is what drives him in his quest to stop human trafficking and child sexual abuse. I believe that it is my effort to defend the right to pursue happiness and to ensure a society and government that defends it as well, he stated. As part of my anti-trafficking work, I've met victims in Russia, I've met victims in India, I've met victims that have been trafficked from Mexico, victims in New York, and New Jersey and all across our country, he continued. While speaking in front of Congress, Kutcher revealed that he had been a part of FBI raids which led him to see unspeakable acts against children. I've seen video content of a child that's the same age as mine, being raped by an American man that was a sex tourist in Cambodia, Kutcher revealed. Kutcher then stated that this child was so conditioned by her environment, that she thought she was engaging in play. The actor revealed that the problem of human trafficking is not foreign to the U.S. I've even on the other end of a phone call from my team asking for my help because we had received a call from the Department of Homeland Security telling us that a seven-year-old girl was being sexually abused and that content was being spread around the dark web, Kutcher said. And she had been being abused and they watched her for three years, and they could not find the perpetrator. We were the last line of defense, an actor and his foundation were the potential last line of defense, Kutcher continued. That's my day job and I am sticking to it. Dot. The $32 billion industry of human trafficking is an epidemic with upwards of 4 million men, women and children worldwide being sold for purposes of labor and sexual exploitation, according to Arc of Hope for Children. Arc of Hope for Children reports that half of those subjected to human trafficking are children. Kutcher is joined by fellow actress Demi Moore, who is also a co-founder on Thorne's board of directors. We join forces with the sharpest minds from tech, nonprofit, government and law enforcement, Thorne states on their website. We work to stop the spread of child sexual abuse material and stand up to child traffickers. We re also uncovering new kinds of abuse, and fighting those two not. 76% of sex transactions involving underage girls begin online, according to Arc of Hope for Children. What do you think? Scroll down to comment below.